Looking for cleaning shortcuts? At Crafty Hackers, we've got you covered. In this video, we'll show you how to remove stains, make your house smell great, and some other great tips. Here are the best cleaning hacks for your room or house. The last one on our list is awesome. Check these out. Jelly Air Freshener. Here's a hack to make the air smell sweet in your room. Just mix some gelatin with water. Stir it well. Now you're gonna use a candle diffuser to heat up your gelatin mixture while you stir it with a spoon. Add a bit of food coloring and about a teaspoon of glycerin. Now for the fragrance. Add a few drops of your favorite smelling essential oil. Lavender, rosemary, and citrus are nice choices to freshen the air. Now move the contents of your mixture into a small votive holder. Once the gelatin solidifies, you'll have an air freshener that keeps your room smelling great. Decorate them with little flowers or sprigs of rosemary or pine. So fancy! Lemon Tea Stain Remover Did you know that lemon has stain removing properties? Here's how it works. Just cut your lemon into quarters and grab your tea stained mug. Think those tea stains are too tough to come out? Think again! Rub the lemon wedge onto the stains and scrub with a scouring pad. Wipe it out with a towel and watch it sparkle. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Cleaning slippers. Want to clean the floors just by walking around in your slippers? It's easy. Just use a Velcro strip and a dust mop. Cut the mop into two foot-sized sections and grab your slippers. Now cut the Velcro into four small pieces and hot glue them to the bottom of your slippers. Glue your slippers to the dust mop. and glide around your room. You can be cozy and clean at the same time. Awesome! When you're done, pull the Velcro apart and toss the dust mops into the washing machine. After you wash them, you can stick them right back onto your slippers. Piece of cake. Sponge hack. For this hack, you'll need a plastic container with a lid. Mark four spots near the four corners on the lid. Cut little X's out on the four spots with an X-Acto knife and cut a big X out in the center. Apply some hot glue around the edges of the lid and glue your sponge into place. Once the glue hardens, remove the sponge lid and put some dishwashing soap inside the container. Reattach the lid. When it's time to wash dishes, you'll have a sponge that is ready to go and already loaded with dish soap. Now you can spend less time washing dishes and more time on DIY crafts. Keyboard hack. Want to get rid of dirt and spots on your keyboard? Try this. Use a bit of nail polish remover, a paintbrush, and some Q-tips. First, use your dry paintbrush to brush away the dust. Then, dip your Q-tip into the nail polish remover. Use it to scrub all the tough spots away. You'll be surprised by how much dirt you pick up. Now moisten a cotton pad with your nail polish remover and give your keyboard a final polish. There, that's better. All-purpose cleaning wipes. Squeeze half a lemon into a container. Use a spoon to take out the seeds. Add some vinegar and some water. Pour in a splash of rubbing alcohol. Sprinkle in some baking soda. The baking soda reacts with the vinegar, making it fizz and bubble. Now squirt in some dish soap. Stir to combine your ingredients. Secure the lid and cut a small square into the center with an X-Acto knife. Take a roll of paper towels and put it into your liquid. Put the lid on and feed the first paper towel through the hole into the lid. Now you've got all-purpose cleaning wipes for your cutlery, mirrors, and any surface you need to clean.
works like a dream. Removing tags. Don't you hate it when stickers won't come off? Here's an easy trick. Put some vegetable oil on a cotton pad. Rub the oil over the sticker. The oil will loosen the sticker adhesive, making it way easier to get those annoying stickers off. If you still have sticker residue, just reapply the vegetable oil. Rub the oil onto the residue, and it should wipe clean. Simple, right? Oil Stain Remover It can be tricky to get oil stains out of clothing, but it's totally doable with this DIY oil stain remover. Sprinkle some baby powder on the stain. Rub it in with your finger. Use a toothbrush to work the powder into the stain. Shake and brush off the excess powder. And watch the stain disappear. The powder soaks up the oil, lifting it off of the fabric. Pretty cool, huh? Waterproof shoes. For this, you just need the wax from a tea candle. Pull the candle out of the holder and rub the wax onto your shoes. Melt the wax with the hairdryer so it forms a protective waterproof coating on the surface of the shoe. See? Totally waterproof. You can see the difference with the untreated shoe. Reed diffusers. This is an awesome way to add some fragrance to your home. Just fill up a jar with vegetable oil. Pour a bit of rubbing alcohol in with the oil. Add some of your favorite essential oil fragrance. Now grab your wood diffusers and place them into your fragrance oil mixture. The wood soaks up the oil, sending the aroma all over the room. Now cut an orange slice in half. Add some dried flowers, cinnamon sticks, and an orange wedge at the top for a decorative flare. Breathe it in and enjoy. Permanent marker remover. Accidentally mark a surface with permanent marker? No problem. All you need is nail polish remover. Put a dab on a cotton pad, rub the spot, and watch the mark disappear. That was easy. The rusty coin trick. If you have a tarnished coin, try this trick to make it shine again. Combine a spoonful of flour and a bit of salt with a spoonful of vegetable oil. Mix the ingredients together. It should form a paste, like this. Now grab a toothbrush. It's time to scrub. Scoop some paste onto the bristles of your toothbrush and scrub the coin. The salt and flour agitate and removes the rust from the tarnished metal and the oil makes it shine again. Cha-ching! Makeup stain remover. Don't you hate it when you get makeup marks on your clothes? We have a simple solution. Use some rubbing alcohol on a cotton pad. Dab it onto the makeup spots. Make sure you fully cover the stain. Now you're going to need some baking soda. Sprinkle it on the area. Dip it into some water and scrub between your fingers. Wring it out and look! The makeup stain has vanished. Saving old leather shoes. In a cup, combine some vinegar and olive oil. Add four or five drops of essential oil. Vanilla works great. Now take the roll top off of an old roll-on deodorant applicator. Use a funnel to minimize spilling and pour the liquid onto the applicator. Wipe the shoes clean with a moist towel and use your applicator to roll on your DIY leather treatment. Rub it in with a dry towel. Now your shoes will be moisturized and protected. See the difference? Not bad at all. Cleaning white sneakers. Get rid of scuff marks on white shoes with this simple hack. Put some cornstarch in a bowl. Add an egg white using this gel to separate the yolk out. Pour in some milk. Stir with a spoon, adding more cornstarch to make the consistency thicker. Now, sprinkle in some baking powder. Give it another stir. Use a toothbrush to scrub away the scuffs using your homemade shoe cleaner. Wipe with a cloth. Good as new. And those were the best cleaning hacks for your room and house. Thanks for watching Crafty Hackers. 
be sure to subscribe to our channel and like our video below. See you next time!